Roger D, sports fans. This is uh, basically just a little demonstration to show you some junk. What I've managed to do with a bit of junk and uh, a generator that I made in a previous video. It's just an AC generator. So here's a load of other components I've managed to pull out of uh, this Iowa tape deck here. Piece of crap, old tape deck. So uh, the feature presentation involves getting an energy saving light bulb, bayonet fitting, pulled the end off it and uh, it's now wired onto the input where you normally used to put the plug in to the uh, to this transformer and the output has got uh, about 8 volts AC running into it from one of the dynamos off the hand cranked torch from Asda so I suppose you're wondering does it work so I'll just turn the light off on my phone uh, and it, it flickers but it's not bad and if I take the bulb off in a minute, you're immediately getting, I mean that's 80 AC volts there and it's got the bulb running on it. Let me just, I want to be careful with this for obvious reasons because I don't fancy getting a ruler in the hand. Just hoping I can pull the bulb off without getting a fucking shock off it. <laughs> right, I managed to do that now, so I'll turn it back on. And you should see the voltage. That's the voltage we're getting off uh, eight, <laughs> eight AC volts to 120 AC volts. So now I most fucking definitely don't want to touch that wire. And that's why it was able to make the light bulb light up. So if you wire transformers up the wrong way around with AC voltage, you can peak it out just quite significantly. And watch you don't hurt yourself because seriously, it's like getting hit in the hand with a ruler. Peace out sports fans, in a bit.